Okay. Now we have our bathroom set as our current layer. If we wanted to change that, we could do it from this drop down menu, but leave it right where it is. We're going to go ahead and draw in a bathtub using our rectangle function and snap to endpoint. I want to start from this bottom corner here. And we're going to use a relative coordinate. So it's going to be at, it's going backwards, so negative in the x direction, 2 feet, 6 inches, and the width on that tub is going to be 5 feet, 10 inches. If you drew your walls correctly from yesterday, this should be a perfect fit. We're going to draw the inside of the tub here and show what that would look like. To do that, right click and reselect rectangle. And we're going to use our object snap to snap from and uh, offset it just a little bit. We're going to offset it with a relative coordinate uh, three inches from each side of this bottom corner. And then the total height, the total inside dimensions are going to be uh, 2 feet by 4 feet 7 inches. And we'll round off the corners with a 3 inch radius. So select fillet and radius. Change your radius to 3 inches. And now we can zoom in. And add our fillets all the way around. Okay starting to look like a bathroom. Uh, we're going to go ahead and add in a couple more rectangles and that's going to be for a sink and for a toilet. Um, I'm going to let you create these on your own. You should be able to reference the picture you have. Use the same kind of methods that we talked about here and we're going to round off the edges of those with a radius of three inches as well.